Kay Kilgore is the chair again of this year's Mount Vernon River Days, and she's here with all the fun for your entire family. Welcome to Lifestyles. Thank you. Thanks for having me. This is the sure. 11th year? Yes. Yes. Wow. It's our 11th year. Uh, this weekend, it's Friday, Saturday, and Sunday, so we're four days away. Um, it's a festival uh, highlighting our riverfront, so we always have it on our riverfront. We've got like 150 food and craft vendors that... Uh, something for everybody that's we, that's a lot to coordinate it, it's it's a lot of uh, <laughs> a lot of vendors that that come and really support the community right. yeah right. we really enjoy it so um and we have all kinds of activities we have um live entertainment throughout the whole weekend so of all different genres of music so um something appeals to everybody um we have uh, this is our 10th anniversary for our smoke on the ohio it's a barbecue competition they're now sanctioned with kc kansas city Barbecue Society. Well, that's a big deal. It is a big I deal. I mean, that is a big deal, especially brings, in our area. Yes, yeah. it brings teams from all over as well as the judges. They're coming from all over the United States just to judge it because you have to be certified to judge. So it brings uh, a, a new audience to River uh, Days. Of course, everybody loves barbecue, so you can't. You oh, can't. It's a win win so. win for everybody. Very much so. Yeah. If nothing else, the smell brings them on in. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. So, um, but we have a motorcycle show, a motorcycle and Jeep show, we have a car show. Uh, this year, new is a 5K color run on Saturday morning. Um, our highlight this year is Indiana Wild, and they're from up at Fort Wayne, Indiana. And um, they're a, a, a animal education and conservation group. So we're going to have a unicorn and a tortoise, a skunk, and several different animals. And, and they'll do oh, the that families. on Friday and kids Saturday. Kids will love that. They're going to love it. And is there a better time throughout the festival for kids and kids' activities or just any time? Any time. Okay. Yeah, the activities. We have inflatables and other children's activities. Um, we have historical demonstrators. So they're there dressed in period wear and doing anything from soap making to candle making. Um, have an old hospital tent, you know, with a um, that's all set up, period, you know. And um, so, yeah, there's definitely something there for everybody. What have you seen, since you've been the, the chairman for the last five years, what have you seen this festival ha has done for the city? Um, it's definitely brought the community together and shown their support because they've really embraced Mount Vernon River Days. And, um, and then just watching the growth, because when we first started Mount Vernon River Days, it was before that they developed the riverfront. So we started it when there were silos down on the river oh, wow. to now all the green space and beautiful park, and the amphitheater and all that. So we saw a lot of changes as well each year through River Days. Well, that's great because it just adds to the city and then it adds does. to your event. Now, it do does. we buy a wristband or get a ticket or is it no, all free? How it's, it's free admission. Um, there are some free um, activities for kids as well as um, things that cost, but most of the vendors there aren't necessarily there to make a bunch of money. As far as for the children's activities, they just want to provide something for the children. Um, so, um, but otherwise, yes, it is free to get in. Um, we have our um, schedule of events, um, and you can go onto our website, mountvernonriverdays.com, or on our Facebook page, Mount Vernon River Days, and it'll have a list of all the vendors, all the food booths, what they're serving. Um, as well as, like I said, the schedule that will have when, what bands are playing and what's all going on on the whole weekend. Our opening ceremony is Friday at 11, and then our closing is at 2.30 on Sunday. And you'll be full of barbecue and good memories. Something. Very <laughs> much so. <laughs> Kay Kilgore, so. have a big time at the Mount Vernon River Days. What Thanks. fun. Thanks Thank for being you. here. Thank you very much. And let's check in with Joe Bird.